Welcome back. Another video, another day. I am not standing in a quarry that I'm not supposed to be in right now, where someone definitely wasn't target practicing. What size do you reckon this is? That's a hefty enough round. I'm gonna say 22 mag. I don't think it's any bigger than a 22 mag. If you know what that is, if you don't, look it up. It's a more powerful version than a standard 22. But anyway, I'm definitely not in a quarry on the way to an abandoned site right now. I'm gonna see if I can get to an abandoned site because the weather is absolutely fab and uh, I'm just looking out for this deep water. That sign that someone shot up back there says there's deep water up here somewhere. Um, so I'm trying to get to a place called Thomastown Castle, but it's not really a castle. It's more kind of a large old house and it's only abandoned between 100 and 150 years. But it seems very hard to get to because it's completely surrounded by farms and there's at least like two through to three fields that you got to pass through. I think I'm on the wrong way. There's like, it's completely surrounded by fields which are privately owned. There's cattle in all of those fields, so I don't want to frighten cattle, and that just wouldn't be ideal. So, uh, I'm tr uh, there's a quarry that joins to the fields. So I'm gonna see if I can get to the edge of this quarry up here, somehow, and um, see if I can get as close as I can to the house slash castle. You decide what it is, but... Uh, If I fall down there, it's gonna hurt. Anyway, I've reached pretty much as far as I can go. Uh, all the ditch has been knocked and it's all black briars, so that will tear me to pieces. But anyway, I'm not gonna trespass on someone's land, especially when there's livestock so close to the site, because I don't know if there's a bull in the middle of all those cows and, uh, you know, I don't wanna be murdered by a bull. So I've got livestock on one side, huge drop off right here to, to first rocks, so you fall off, you're like, oh shit, maybe I landed in the water, I might be okay. No, you hit the rocks first, and then you roll into the water, just to make sure. It's like, well, we didn't know. So, and I've got electric fence on this side. So I'm gonna keep walking up a tiny bit more. Technically that's trespassing. This is trespassing, but not as bad, because no one's gonna come out to this quarry, it's abandoned. Uh, but there's fresh tractor marks and everything here. But, sorry for talking all the time. I'm going to show you the gates of this place, then I'm going to pan left to the obstructed view of the castle. House. House castle. So here it is. But there, as you can see, there's livestock right up against it. So it's quite a calm day. I'm going to get the drone up and we're going to fly off over, get some nice shots. It's going to be a short enough video. Get some nice shots of the castle house thing. And um, we'll see how that goes. Yeah. But I would love to be able to get into this thing. I'm going to link below pictures of actually inside of it. It's just like an old house, it's an old ruin, like tons of them we've been to, so, you know. Anyway, here it is. So, as I'm flying the drone, 
I hear this banging, right? Like doom, doom, doom near to me. And I was like, what the hell is that? There's a reason I have my hood up, by the way. <laughs> um, so I'm flying the drone off over there, getting some cool shots, really concentrating to fly through the buildings and stuff. And uh, lucky I didn't decide to walk down the fields because there's a farmer in his Jeep right over there. I don't know if you can catch it. Let me zoom in on him. Yeah, so thing is, I blend with this grass well enough for him not to see me. <laughs> Camouflage is everything. Camouflage is everything. So um, I just kind of face this way. So if you if you give a quick glance, I'm, I think I'm far enough away for him to give a quick glance and just to not see and nothing out of the ordinary uh, to pop out. But camouflage <laughs> and unplanned camouflage at that. So yeah, that's been the video. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, that place is really cool. I'd love to go in and have a look at it, but I'm not willing to do that without like getting special permission from whoever is in charge of the yard. May do that at some point, but um, that's been that's been Thomastown Castle slash house. You decide whether it's a castle or a house, and look up also the history of it. Apparently, the roof was taken apart back in the War of Independence, I think, for uh, lead. There was lead on the roof and they needed that for ammunition or for whatever. So they, apparently they just stripped the roof of lead and it went to ruin then. There's not a whole lot online about it. Uh, I'll link, as I said, I'll link below the page um, with the information that I found on it. Um, but as, par as far as years go and everything, I didn't really look that up, to be honest. I just wanted to come out and see a cool castle. Um, but anyway, that's been the video. Hope you enjoyed. Probably gonna put this bit in before the drone footage, so that, you know. But he is... Yeah, he's really going to town with the sledgehammer right now, so... Thank God I didn't, uh... Thank God I didn't... Go over there and get caught by him, because he's in a jeep. Anyway, the farmer is casually walking this way. I don't know where he is, but I am crouched down now. And I think that he has seen me, so I am just going to leave the area in a weird crouch, crouch position. Away I go. Oh yes, he is certainly looking at me. Okay, we're just gonna walk naturally. We're not doing anything. We're in a quarry, not on his land. Maybe he's seen the drone. <laughs> oh. He's, yeah, he's turned away. So he was walking directly towards me as I was packing up everything and I was actually just about to pack up the camera. And thank God I got the drone away. I just picked up the camera bag and left as keeping an eye on him. Hey, this quarry is sick. Now I'll see you in the next video. Every little thing you do Every time you hold me, take me higher